Hello everyone, welcome to week three of the staff video clips. I hope you're all keeping well. Um, wanted to say well done to everyone for staying at home, uh, doing your bit to help the nation fight the coronavirus. I've um, been speaking to a lot of people in the community who said it's been very quiet in illness in the surrounding villages. Um, I've cycled into work a couple of times um, and not seen anybody. So well done, keep it up. Uh, we're all really proud of, of all the efforts that you're all making. Thought I'd start by telling you what I've been up to. Um, I've been fortunate enough to be able to go into school uh, every single week. And um, schools are, calling it school is a bit of a strange word at the moment because it doesn't feel like school. Um, because the majority of you aren't in there. We haven't got lessons in there. Um, and it's a very strange place, as Mr Walker has already said, um, to, to be in. Um, but I've been in, I've seen some of the pupils, um, the, some of the key worker pupils um, who've been coming in regularly and have been having some excellent support from our uh, amazing staff. Um, at home, I've been doing jobs around my house, a bit of gardening, a bit of painting, a bit of tidying um, and some baking. I've been doing a bit of baking, trying not to eat too much. Uh, of the stuff that I'm baking but not being very successful with that um, and that's meant that I've needed to keep to my exercise plan um, over the last few weeks trying to get out and about trying to do stuff regularly um, and as Dr Watts said last week in his video message important to to get a bit of a timetable if you like of, of things to do both learning stuff and non-learning stuff um, I've taken the opportunity to uh, reconnect with some of my um, cousins who I haven't spoken to in, in a couple of years um, and that's been a really positive thing to come out of, uh, of the current situation uh, and I've also taken up a new hobby um, take, got a bit of a TikTok account going at the moment uh, I'm not very good uh, and I haven't got much on there and uh, you won't find it because as you would hope um, the account settings are on private as I hope yours are as well e-safety really really important Moving on to the Padlets, thank you to everyone who's contributed to, to the Padlets about computing. Um, particular thanks to those of you that have offered solutions and suggestions to, to fellow pupils when they've had particular issues. I know a lot of you have had problems uh, accessing Python in particular in Year 7 um, and some of the other programs. Uh, and my message to you is, don't worry if that is the case. If you're not able to access the computing work for whatever reason, don't worry, don't stress, it's not a problem, just move on to something else. I've tried to set some additional work with computing uh, that hopefully you can access, but again, if you can't, don't worry. We'll deal with it when we all come back to school. The most important thing is, uh, is that you don't worry about the work if you can't complete it. All we ask, all I ask, is that you give it your best go. And if that uh, means that you give it a best go and you can't do the work, then that is fair enough as far as I'm concerned. Uh, Dr. Watts mentioned about a timetable. Just wanted to emphasise that particularly with your learning. There's lots of online learning for you to, to access. Um, and that at times can be a little bit, appear a little bit overwhelming. Um, so pick maybe three or four things to, to do each day. Um, and work your way through those and if you don't get to the end of those then don't worry um, because there's always tomorrow to do some more some more of that learning um, so that's it from me for my message uh, in the words of the prime minister and the nation stay at home protect the nhs and save lives and most of all keep washing those hands stay safe everyone <laughs>